Jeff is performing in alignment right now on a 2013 F350, F450. And right now he's doing the rollback. The rollback cancels out any run out in the wheel, hob, or what have you, so we get accurate measurements. As you can see, while well, you do the rollback, it also measures your overall tire diameter. So on all-wheel drive vehicles, that makes a difference. If you have tires that are not the same circumference, you could damage your transmission. Now Jeff is performing a caster sweep. This measures camber on both front wheels at 10 degrees left and right, and that's how we achieve your caster measurement. So now it's taking the measurement on the left front wheel and right front. Now we're taking a 10 degree measurement of camber on the right front, left front wheel to the right. In two seconds here, we'll have the final measurements of the vehicle. Here's the static measurements, front and rear of this vehicle. The next button. This is the rear setup. And this is the front. Now that we have the measurements up, Jeff can make the adjustments to make sure this truck does not wear tires or pull left or right. So to continue the video, this is the front end of that F450 that I was previously in the specs up on. And we're the toe adjustment, that's how the wheels toe in or toe out, like pigeon toe or duck foot. And the adjustment is made in this rod, okay? So I can bring the wheels, you know, in or out. And then to center the steering wheel, we center right here. This is called the upper drag link assembly. And you can turn that buckle, turn buckle, which it just, you know, adjusts the steering wheel center. Okay, on this F450, we're also putting four Fox shocks on along with the steering damper. You know, the oblig obligatory Dale's logo. Gotta put that in there. Look at the shock bushing. Just pounded. And these shocks haven't been in that long. This truck lives off-road. Okay, there's the front steering damper. And there's the Fox front shock. And these are longer shocks because it has a level off kit installed, which will, you know, it requires a longer shock or you top it out. The shocks we pulled out were a little short and it eliminated the upper bushing. In a, 